77. Number 77. So this is the first of two consecutive games between these two doors. You expect much of a feeling out period? You know, I don't know, Brian, but what I think is you always stay true to your habits immediately. You guys understand who we are and how we win. Are we a defensive first oriented team? If that's the case, you come out and set that tone right from the outset. Game two, then you worry about adjustments. And MP's made no secret that one of his main focuses this season is taking down the top teams in the league. His motivation in games like this has been clear. Well, credit to MP for his role in helping this team step up to the level of competition. They may not be infallible, but they're an absolute force. They can beat any team in the league on any given night. And this matchup gives them another opportunity to prove that. So the opening lineup here for the Clippers. Harden and Powell, their backcourt. Kawhi and Zubats make up the frontcourt. And it's Smith in at the three. And about a minute gone in the first quarter. Pass to Lively. Thompson with it. Shot clock at six. And the three off target. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. MP against Thompson. Shoots from the line. Count the basket. MP's got his second bucket of the night. Uh, that's big time. Mental strength right there from MP. Guys in your space, don't let it deter you. That one drops for him. And setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? To me, that's a complete lack of communication on that side of the ball. These guys need to be talking to each other. Now here's Smith. Last game, an incredible scoring display for him. Out to Powell. Smith with a screen on Irving. For three, Powell. Doncic grabs the miss. For Dallas, they've gone just two for four from the floor. From outside the arc. And Irving with the basket. On the assist by Washington. Boy, the range of Kyrie and the quickness and efficiency with which he gets it off. Look out. Harden finds Smith. Pass to Zubats. Smith with a screen on Lively. Zubat passes to Leonard. Doncic against Harden. MP inside. Knocked away. Doncic deciding where to go with it. Oh, excellent D there from Harden. Well, this is the kind of shot we've come to expect him to make. He's got to be upset with that one. Grant, as long as the Mavs have Luka Doncic, they'll be a contender in the West. Yeah, no doubt. Luka is the special guy who can carry a team. He's an MVP candidate year in and year out. And Dallas is just very lucky to have him. Great effort to turn the miss into two points. Yes, sir. Those are the hustle points. And Ty Lu has called a timeout. He's going to talk it over with his guys. And for an idea of how the league is shaping up right now, take a look at these latest power rankings. You take a look at the Celtics. They're building some momentum right now and aiming for a spot in the top five. You know, for the Clippers, they're kind of a middle-of-the-road squad. Not bad, but haven't been able to make the leap into the upper echelon of teams. Leonard outside. Pass to Powell. Now MP. Good. Third basket in six attempts. Oh, MP. He got that tweener working. And we're just over three and a half minutes into this first quarter. Thompson with a screen. Over MP. And the Mavericks getting another bucket right there. His absolute best. Clay Thompson rise and fire on the catch. Good night defense. Smith against Thompson. Powell outside. Zubox with a screen on Irving. Gets the three to fall. Powell can really shoot it from three. That's a great possession for this team. Washington outside. Back to Doncic. 
Irving looking around. Lays it up and banks it in. Irving's got five now. Well, the versatility he possesses makes him a very tough cover, guys. Smith outside. Zubox with a screen on Thompson. Here's MP. Tips. Well, on top of the length he provides and athleticism, there are the shot-blocking instincts of Derek Lively. Wow. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. Now here's Thompson. What a tremendous game he played against San Antonio. Doncic. Washington, left side. No good with the triple. Los Angeles has gone two for three from outside the arc. Pass to Leonard. Smith against Thompson from 10 feet away. The rebound by Klay Thompson. He's been off this whole period. Unable to sustain any kind of consistency. And here's Doncic outside. Drains the triple. Doncic has got his second bucket on the night. Fearless, as always. Doncic loves to fill it up for deep. And Los Angeles making a change here. Porter Jr.'s checked in. And let's take a look at the top rookie rebounders. MP, number one. And even though he's a rookie, he doesn't fear anyone. When it comes to rebounding the ball, he's all business and shows a lot of heart doing it. Pass to Leonard. 4-3. Nails it from three. Leonard's gotten his second bucket of the game. This defense just can't stay connected to shooters. Doncic passes to Lively. And here is Thompson. Doncic outside. Thompson outside. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. Harden with it. And Lively picks him up defensively. Here's Smith. And the Clippers again with a bucket. You can see inexperience does not prevent MP from finding his spots and capitalizing. And let's send it over to Allie LaForce. A bit ago, Jason Kidd and I were able to chat. Who told me that one key will be holding James Harden in check. He said they don't want to let Harden get too much penetration. And when he does drive the lane, they're going to shade him left and force him into his weaker right hand. It's a strategy teams have used on Harden before, so we'll see how effective it is tonight. Allie, thank you. Now here's Smith. Give him eight points now. Back to Leonard. Takes a three. Doncic pulls down the board. Dallas has gone three of six shooting from beyond the arc. Well, Doris, there's one thing for sure. When Kawhi Leonard is available, he's elite. There's no question about it, Brian. And it's so difficult to watch a player who cares so deeply about the game as Kawhi does not have his body hold up. It's been unfortunate over the years to see the toll injuries have taken on his career. But boy, oh boy, clutch, skilled, competitive, tough, every attribute you could want. Let's remember, this guy's got a 9-4 standing reach and a vertical that's ridiculous, lively, just getting to the rim. Now here's MP. Leonard on the wing from behind the arc. Good, and the assist goes to MP. Leonard's got nine points. Pick works well there, but the defense left a lot to be desired. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of the offensive player. You've got to want to work. And the shot's good by Irving. He has seven. They just look so overwhelmed inside. Yeah, that's why they continue to get attacked. Zubac with a screen on Thompson. Smith. Leonard outside. MP, a screen on Washington. The three. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Thompson's got his fourth rebound in this one. In transition, here come the Clippers. Shots blocked. Harden against Doncic. Over Harden. The rebound by MP. Clippers trail by three. Oh, 
Leonard outside. Jacks up a three. Drops in the three. We've seen this script before. Kawhi Leonard starts early and continues throughout the course of the night. Defense is in for a long haul. Now here's Doncic. Last game we saw him with 32 points. To the wing on the left. Washington finds Lively. Now here's Doncic. Hits the trifecta. And the Mavericks lead by three. Well, they're calling his number time and time again, and he is delivering. And it's Porter with the ball for Los Angeles. Fresh off a win against the Pacers. They had a lot of breaks go their way in that game, and hey, they cashed in when they could. Well, you have to capitalize when your opponent has miscues and give this team some credit. Every time that opponent turned it over, they capitalized. So it's the Mavericks now, following the score by Los Angeles. Thompson passes to Washington. Doncic outside. And that one goes. He's shooting five of nine in this one. You can see it. Once this guy gets his rhythm, he is so hard to slow down. What an excellent night for him and his team. Now here's Porter. Hasn't gotten on the fall yet. Doris, not long ago, the Clippers were not associated with star power. It's very true, VA, but they are now. And it's not just the talent that they have. It's the experience that their guys bring to the court. They now have a core of big-time players who've been through virtually everything in the league. The last pick of the first round in 2019, Porter Jr. plays with a chip on his shoulder. I love the competitive attitude. Porter hits them both. And Jason Kidd inking a multi-year contract extension, Doris. He'll remain the Dallas head coach. Well, B.A., you have to give Jason a ton of credit for the job he's done with this basketball team. And think about it. Your coach is a Hall of Fame-level floor general in his own right. And now your best player, Luka Doncic, is an elite point guard. Just a perfect match. Sinks it from distance. Doncic has got 16 points. What an aggressive mindset in this period. He's starting to take over. Harden, the pass to Bamba. Pass to Mann. Six to shoot. And he drops in the layup off the glass. Pounding it inside early and often, setting a physical tone. 52 seconds left in the opening quarter. Here's Doncic. Rebound by the Clippers. And this is a shot he can definitely make, and the defense not a factor at all. Pass to Bamba. Outside man. Here's Harden. Unable to get the tying bucket there. The Mavericks leading. Here's Grimes. That three's off the mark. Man, the pass to Porter. Inside. Here's Harden. Cash. Assisting on the play was Porter. Sees his man has the angle on the interior and drops a dime right there. From deep, here's Doncic. Oh, what a performance by Luka Doncic. He has been the story for the Mavericks. Torching the Nets, hitting four from distance that quarter. We'll be back in a moment. And we hope you're enjoying the game. for the Mavericks. MPs checked in for Los Angeles. Norm Powell comes in for Porter Jr. Right side, Irving. Pass to Marshall. Fires for three. Powell pulls it in. The Clippers have gotten just two of six field goals to go in the second. And so in the game... Oh! oh he did it! Punch it home! Nice! Boy, MP, what a fancy finish. Irving, the pass to Exum. The three is up. Irving, 
No good. I'll tell you, it's been a struggle for him in this period, and they're struggling as a result. Smith. And the bucket counts, and he is on his way to the line. He'll try to make it a three-point play. The Mavericks making a switch here. Grimes has checked in. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for Los Angeles. Well, they found a groove, and it's from distance, so knocking them down from the three-point land never hurts. Yeah, and in addition, their ball movement has really unleashed their offense. Well, they've been fun to watch. Now here's Washington. Coming off a 16-point game against the Spurs in San Antonio. Oh, man, he can't get anything to fall. You can feel his frustration. He is trying to shoot his way out of it, and it might be better for him to pass the basketball at this point. Work in the interior, MP. And why go away from attacking inside if the D has no answer for you? And so Jason Kidd calls for the timeout, and we might see some changes. Coach potentially looking to adjust. So for Dallas, Lively, he's checked in for Gafford. Clay Thompson comes in for Grimes. And Doncic has subbed in for Kyrie Irving. Kawhi Leonard's checked in for the Clippers. Pass to Thompson. Washington with the ball. Here's Marshall. And they'll get another chance. Doncic, good. This guy is an absolute machine. Luka Doncic keeping his foot on the gas and giving the defense everything they can handle. Now here's MP. 17 points in the game. It's good. And he drew contact on the shot, so he will go to the line. A three-point play opportunity. Los Angeles shooting their sixth attempt at the charity stripe in the game. Well, Grant, you were an excellent defender in your day. So who was the toughest player you had to guard? Well, there were so many great players. Michael, LeBron. Well, let's talk about the late, great Kobe Bryant. I mean, he really had no weaknesses. And even if you defended him perfectly, there's a good chance he can still make the shot. Takes it in. Out to Powell. Back to MP. Just five to shoot. Unloads from 13. And the Clippers again with a bucket. In such a rhythm right now. Feathery touch. He's lighting them up. Mavericks trail by 12. Things just don't seem to be clicking for them offensively. Yeah, they really need to find a way to get back on track. Here's Marshall. Now covers. The three from Washington. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Their last encounter was in Los Angeles. And that night, they did a great job of executing their plays and creating mismatches. Well, it was certainly a game that their analytics people had to love breaking down. I thought they exposed every weakness in the defense. Let's check in with our reporter, Allie LaForce. Thanks, guys. Well, MP in their last time out against the Pacers was simply terrific. He dropped 56 points, and he made a lot of shrewd decisions with the ball, which led to a hefty assist total for him. What a game for him, and against their rivals, no less, which had to make him feel extra special. Guys, back to you. Okay, Allie, thanks. Well, that was an incredible night for him. They rode him to that win. And he was more than happy to carry them, B.A. He might still be feeding off that performance heading into this one. Well, there's no doubt. He certainly looked like he was enjoying himself in that last game. He had his offense flowing. And Doris, the Clippers with new jerseys, a shiny new arena, and an ownership group that is very aggressive. They want some shiny hardware to go with it. B.A., you have to appreciate an ownership group that is willing to spend and make all the right moves in order to position yourself for the championship. But now the players need to come through. And what has been their undoing in recent years is injuries and the lack of availability of their best players. Age and health still hover over this organization. Now Los Angeles with it. They're on a 20-7 run. Out to Leonard. Fires the three. He can't get that one to fall. Mavericks trail by 12. To the paint. Washington passes to Thompson. Now here's Doncic. He's guarded by Porter. Doncic is double. Pass to Washington. Beyond the arc. Batum pulls it in. He came out today planning to do as much damage from three-point range as possible. Well, it looks like it's time to change up the plan, guys. Now here's Smith. He's got 24. 
Porter looks it over. And again, it's the Clippers missing. Maybe he rushes that just a little bit. Who knows? But he couldn't have gotten a better look than that. Thompson finds Doncic. Lively with a screen on Leonard. Here's Doncic. Powell pulls it in. The Clippers lead by 12. Smith in the high post. Over Washington. A nice shot by MP. Smith's got 26 points. He's on a roll in this quarter. The defense better be careful. Thompson outside. Shot from 12. Count that bucket. Yeah, you keep defenders guessing with the ability to get to that in-between game. Part of what makes Clay Thompson an all-star. Porter against Doncic. Off target from outside. And so Thompson will bring it up for the Dallas Mavericks. To the middle. Here's Washington. That one falls. Great setup by Doncic. Doncic has got three assists now in this one. Credit their discipline. They've been working for high percentage shots. Now here's MP. He's got 26. What a terrific move that is. And he's got 28 now. Yeah, this defense looks absolutely helpless trying to stop MP right now. He's having his way out there. Marshall passes to Thompson. Oh, Thompson buries the tray. I'll tell you, he's having his way right now in the second period. Forget the first quarter. Let's get to work. Pass to Batum. MP scanning the floor. Batum sets a screen. MP inside. Marshall's there. Misses in close. Doncic with it. Picked up by Powell. Now here's Washington. To the right side. Here's Marshall. Fires in the triple. Marshall's gotten himself going here. His first point of the game on the deep ball. The Clippers lead by six. Smith outside. There's 49 seconds left to play in the half. Boy, against so little defensive pressure, you have to convert that. Pass to Marshall. The basket drops, and he gets fouled on the shot. One free throw coming his way. And off the jump, they were effective from deep. I don't know why they haven't continued to fire from out there. Kyrie Irving's checked in for Washington. Ivica Zubac's checked in for Los Angeles. James Harden comes in for Porter Jr. Muscling it home, MP. He's carried much of the scoring load tonight. And with the win in reach, don't expect him to let up. Mavericks trail by six. Doncic passes to Marshall. Thompson outside. So it'll be two free throws. He was fouled in the act of shooting. And give them credit for making a more concerted effort to get to the line this quarter. First one falls for him. His contemporaries will say this. Clay Thompson's shooting stroke is as pure as it gets. Washington's checked in for Dallas. You can tell when he steps to the line the kind of confidence he has in himself. It's written all over his body language. Here's MP. 30 points in the game. Elbow shot on the way. Oh, he got it up in time, but it wouldn't fall for him. And so it's MP making things happen for the Los Angeles Clippers. He's been an offensive force. Now with over 30 points after the quarter. More NBA on 2K Sports right after this. Hello folks, is this the halftime show? 
Yes, it is. And kicking it off, let's quickly look at the Western Conference standings. Taking a look at the Clippers. They've been hanging around the upper echelon, playing with good energy. Feels like the chemistry is right with this team. They put themselves in the championship discussion. And let's get into this first half. A super close game for the Clippers so far. We often talk about efficiency on offense. They were the... And that's a wrap on halftime. Thanks for watching. And after a fairly even first couple of quarters, this second half could turn out to be a great one as both teams trying to gain an edge. Hey, you look at MP in this game. He's been everywhere. Man, I love how effortlessly he scored. The game just comes so easy for him. Now let's see if he continues that trend the rest of the way. He certainly has the talent and the endurance to do just that. Irving and Thompson fill out the wings. Washington and Lively down low. And it's Doncic in at the one. That's Jason Kidd's five as we get into the second half. Irving for three. He drops it from range. Irving's got ten points in the game. Excellent setup. The pre-shop preparation getting into that catch-and-shoot game. We see it, Kyrie. It's deflected. Harden against Doncic. And it's Harden who pulls down the rebound. The Clippers lead by three. And about a minute of action so far in the third quarter. Back to Smith. Leonard with a screen on Thompson. Five to shoot. Ooh, and Leonard throws it down. You know, you see how comfortable MP is operating pick and rolls? Just great decision making from him. And Doncic has got the ball here for Dallas. Who's watching here? Pass to Thompson. Now Washington. The three is up. It's rebounded by Zubats. Zubats has got rebound number seven tonight. MP outside. Out to Leonard. The three ball. And the rebound goes to Dallas. Doncic has got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. And that one's good. Thompson. They're getting torched on the perimeter. Four of the last five buckets have been threes. Now Smith. He's got 32 points. Leonard outside. From downtown. Leonard can't get that one to fall. Dallas has gone two of three from outside so far in the third quarter. Inside, Washington. And he got the whistle on the way up. So he'll be headed to the line for a pair. Doris, one place you see this Dallas team show up is in the hustle stats. B.A., this version of the Dallas Mavericks is as tough and as pretty and as willing to compete as any I've seen. I think you have to admire the aggressiveness with which P.J. Washington plays every single night. Smith. Doncic pulls down the board. Doncic has got double-digit rebounds now in the game. Pass to Lively. The shot is good. Doncic making the play. Doncic has got four assists in the game. <laughs> I just love the ball move. MP outside. Zubac screen. MP the pass to Zubac. It's stolen by Lively. Clock keeps going. Three minutes into the second half now. Thompson against Smith. Clock at six. Here's Doncic. He can't get it to go. Harden with the defensive effort. The Clippers trail. Can they get it? MP no good. Well, whether it's a defensive adjustment or he's gone just a bit cold, that efficiency has really fallen off this quarter. And here's Thompson for three. It's rebounded by Zubats. Zubats has got ten rebounds here tonight. So active. And Ty Lu has called a timeout. He wants to make sure everybody's on the same page. You know, one guy who's been getting it done is Luka Doncic. 
Well, I think this is a necessary timeout so they can figure out a way to limit the impact this guy's having from three-point range. They've got to dedicate more resources to their perimeter D. On the wing, MP, covered by Lively. Oh, nice shot by MP. Yeah, sometimes your teammate gets you open with a screen. MP able to capitalize. Thompson outside. Back to Doncic. Over Leonard. Pass to Lively. To the left side wing. Outside Irving. Lively with a screen on Powell. Fires top of the key. Oh, great D that time from Powell. For Los Angeles, they've gone cold here in this third quarter. Just three of nine. And here's Smith. He's got 34. Leonard passes to MP. Zubats with it. Leonard outside. To the inside. Here's MP. And no good. Had a chance to take the lead. Dallas has gotten two of four threes to fall here in this third quarter. Out to Thompson. Doncic against Harden. The three from Washington. He buries it from three. Washington's got five points in the quarter. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. Oh, and the dunk by MP. That's exactly what you want to see from MP at this stage of his career. Get to the rim and leave no doubt. Washington outside. Back to Doncic. That shot, no good. Good work defensively by Leonard. And let's swing it over to the sideline and hear from Alley. Hey, Brian, the Mavericks are looking to contend. Coach Jason Kidd said, we're trying to build a championship team, and it's not easy. Dallas has not talked about that for a long time. So to talk about that, it's pretty cool. To be able to build it takes time. We have the personnel. We have the team. Brian, that's confidence. Yep, and they're in win-now mode, Allie. Thank you. Well, there's just such a subtle nuance to what Clay Thompson does. He is the master of working off screens. Porter Jr., he's checked in for the Clippers. Clippers trail by three. Harden from outside. And the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Doncic has got 11 rebounds in the game. Irving, the pass to Doncic. Oh, Luka, so hard to stop. He drops yet another dive, just facilitating this offense like a maestro. Los Angeles has got nothing to fall from outside in this third quarter. Harden, the pass to MP. Shot from 12. Tried to bank it in, but it misses. The Mavericks lead by five. Shoots from 14. Kawhi Leonard comes up with a rebound. Well, it hasn't been the most efficient game for this guy, but their team is fortunate to still be out in front. Now here's MP. He's got 38. Thompson with a steal. And they're on the break. Here's Washington, and Washington powers it through. Now that pass is a product of Kyrie Irving's great instincts. He's got a terrific mind for the game. Harden, the pass to MP. Back to Harden, pass to Leonard. Smith with it. Six on the shot clock. Yet another bucket. And hats off to him. I mean, he's got the longest 40-point streak in league history. Unreal. He's been on a scoring binge we've never seen before. Doncic outside. Here's Irving. Boy, clanks that one off the back iron and it falls. Irving's got 13 now. And he's coming off a huge performance, and his confidence couldn't be any higher. And his coach knows that, too. Well, the best players, to me, deliver night after night after night. So as long as he's hot, 
keep riding it. Washington against Harden. Here's Doncic. Luka! Get off me! Yeah, an offensive player like Luka expects the contact. He's anticipating it, so it doesn't bother him. That's a big-time finish. Leonard outside. Good, and the assist goes to MP. MP's got six assists here tonight. Here's Doncic. He's got 25. Outside Irving. Takes the three. The Clippers grab the miss. Oh, and the fast break for the Clippers. Washington grabs the miss. Dallas leading by six. Thompson passes to Doncic. No good on the three. In the first half, he was on fire from range, but he hasn't knocked one down since. Pass to Porter. Thompson against Smith. Leonard outside. There's the three. Oh, and another three for the Clippers. Yeah, in the first half, he was unstoppable from deep. Now, two more since the break. And so Jason Kidd calls for the timeout. He wants to give him a breather and talk things over. And the map. And it's Porter with the ball for Los Angeles. They trail by one. And so in the game for the Clippers, we've got Nicholas Batum. MP is out there with Terrence Mann. Then it's Norman Powell. And it's Porter in at the point. Wow, look at the creativity from that young man. MP putting on a show with the handle. Irving for three. And it's out of bounds. They say it was last touch by Irving. Los Angeles shooting a nice 50% for the game. MP inside. He's guarded by Washington. Here's MP. And Gafford with the block. Do not go up soft against Daniel Gafford. He will send it right back at you. From deep, MP. Gafford grabs the miss. Gafford's got six rebounds in the game. Stolen. Oh, and the fast break for the Clippers. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. This guy's so clever at getting defenders to bite. Nicholas Batum draws the contact. And that one goes in. Two from the line that time. And so it's Dallas with it. It's a three-point game. And we played through about a minute here in the fourth. Irving for three. Goes back up. And finished off by Gafford as he lays it in. That'll drive your coach crazy, failing to box out. Ugh. And to me, this is a common theme that's running through the league right now. Guys looking to leak out rather than box out. Now Smith. Batum with a screen on Washington. Smith. Washington grabs the miss. Dallas has gone 0 for 2 from outside here in the fourth quarter. Pass to Irving. Here's Grimes. Back to Irving. On the wing, Irving. Second shot opportunity. And it's good on the layup. And the Mavericks lead by one. Now, Kyrie may be the best finishing guard in the history of the game. His ability to contort his body or spin the basketball, ridiculous. And again, it's the Clippers missing. Boy, the wheels have definitely fallen off in this quarter. He cannot buy one. Grimes, the pass to Marshall. Outside Irving. Down to five on the shot clock. And it's the Clippers with the rebound. Pass to MP. 
Just over two and a half minutes played now. Final quarter of regulation. And he gets it to go. Relentless in his approach. He has one thing on his mind. Close this game out. Into the lane. Prime shot is off. The Clippers in the lead. Batum, the pass to MP. Ooh, bruising drive from MP. You see on that drive right there, that's just burst from MP. For Dallas, they've gone two for seven from the field here in the fourth. Not great. Washington, left side. Pass to Grimes. Launches a three. Smith with the rebound. MP's got four rebounds now. Outside man. The three. Good. And the assist goes to MP. Three points. Smith's got assist number eight here already in the game. Mavericks trail by six. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Here's Irving. And that one is right through the heart. Irving's got ten points here in the second half. And that was the right decision. When you're in need of a bucket, you go to your most trusted guys. Well, you've got to earn trust and equity by making shots. Nice delivery there. And it's Smith penetrating. Strong finish on the drive by MP. Yeah, MP capitalizing on being so close to the hoop. Here's Grimes. Left side Irving. Crafty move. And it's good as he snugs it right through the net. Irving's got 19 points. Los Angeles leading by four. And here's Smith. On the take. And the rebound goes to Dallas. Gafford's got nine rebounds in the game. Boy, he's getting it done. Washington passes to Irving. Back to Washington. Gafford with a screen on Smith. Down low. Washington finds Gafford. Count that one. And now just a two-point Los Angeles lead. And you want him taking good shots at this point in the game. And that one was easy. Boy, when it's this close, you try not to give up these kinds of buckets. Boy, you got to be better defensively. From the baseline. Again. What an avalanche. <laughs> My goodness. 50 for the game. Just putting on a show. Now here's Irving. Shoots over Powell. Another one falls for Dallas. What a masterful performance from Kyrie Irving. He's over a decade into his career. He can still take over a game. Washington against MP. Gafford with the block. Here's Grimes. Powell covers. The pass to Washington. Gafford in the post. Quarters there. And Gafford gets it to go. On the assist by Washington. Washington's got five assists in the game. And timeout called by Ty Lu, Rallying his guys to make sure they all know the plan. So for Dallas, Lively, he's checked in for Gafford. Thompson comes in for Marshall. And Doncic has subbed in for Grimes. Here's MP. Another bucket! Wow! <laughs> That's 52 points for him. Making it all look too easy right now. The Mavericks have gotten seven to go out of 13 attempts during the fourth. Thompson, a screen on Leonard. To the paint. Thompson against Smith. And no good. Los Angeles has gone one for three in the fourth quarter from range. Leonard on the wing. Puts up a three. Leonard! 
third. A threat from deep. He got loose from downtown in the first half. Now has three here in the second. Unstoppable. Doncic outside. Lively with a screen on Leonard. Doncic passes to Lively. Washington outside. Sends it home from three-point land. And that's a clutch shot by a big-time shooter. And where's the D? Irving against Harden. Three-pointer. The Mavericks pull it in. Lively's got rebound number nine now. What an effort here tonight. Washington passes to Irving. Doncic outside. And he lobs it up to the rim. And a slam dunk by Lively. You just put it in the vicinity of Derek Lively. You think you overthrow it. Lively goes and gets it. Harden surveying the D on the wing. MP. Takes a turnaround, Jay. Doncic pulls down the board. Dallas is shooting around 53% on the fourth. Up top, Lively to take the lead. Basket is good. Nice setup from Irving. Irving's got six assists here tonight. You see the offensive force that is Kyrie Irving. Sometimes it's a scoring right there. It's just passing. Leonard outside. No good again that time. The Mavericks leading. And they're dialed in offensively. Sure are. Staying in attack mode and at the same time playing under control. They could have used more of those kind of rebounds earlier. It's hurt their cause. Smith finds Porter. Leonard outside. MP inside. Defended by Thompson. They get it back. Outside for Porter. From deep. Knocks down the long chain. And the Clippers lead by one. Yeah, incredible range. Porter Jr. can cash you in from distance. He certainly did there. Leonard against Doncic. And there's the whistle. Illegal screen is the call. Boy, not on the same page there. And the possession ball game, that's a big mistake. One of the trickier plays to judge, but it would be hard to argue against the call. It is really difficult to get your feet completely set, to stay completely still. It's almost surprising to me that it isn't called more often. Norman Powell, he's checked in for Porter Jr. MP, the pass to Harden. MP against Thompson. Shoots from 12. And he gets it to go off the front iron. MP's got 54 points. MP showing you early. He can handle the pressure, folks. Stolen by Harden. Leonard inside. Washington's there. And the basket by Leonard. Leonard's got 28. Well, Kawhi Leonard has been in so many big-time situations. How confident is he right there? Doncic against Leonard to stop the run. And it's Doncic missing. And it's Powell with the ball for the Clippers. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. A minute 20 left to play in the fourth quarter of this one. Puts it up from 12. Doncic pulls down the board. Doncic has got 13 rebounds in the game. Glass heating. This guy is as difficult to cover as there is in the NBA. Kyrie Irving, the master at drawing contact. And a look now at how the offensive approach has been going here so far for the Clippers. I've been impressed with how assertive they've been offensively. Getting the ball into the low post and powering through the defense. The other thing that's been impressive is really just relentless driving the basketball. Doesn't matter if the defense is there. They are challenging them and getting it done. Here's Smith. And so he draws the foul. Headed to the line to shoot a pair. Clay Thompson picks one up. Oh, pressure here for MP, folks. First free throw is good. And that gives him a four-point cushion. And 
and he's unable to get the second one. Guys, I don't see how you can't be excited about the future for MP. This guy's got a great head on his shoulders. His first focus is winning, and you don't see that that often from a young man this age. Outside Harden. Leonard on the wing. Pass to Harden. MP up top. And they double up MP. Harden, the pass to MP. Shot clock at five. Stolen by Thompson. And it's good. Fought through contact. Hit the shot and will go to the line. Well, this is why you run your offense through him in important situations. You know he's going to deliver. And so they foul intentionally. Getting a little desperate at this stage. I mean, the clock's the big factor. Good on the first. And that'll put him up two. And so he drops them both. And it's a three-point game. That last free throw was a huge, huge shot. The difference between a two and a three-point lead at this stage is major. And so Jason Kidd calls for the timeout. And a great call on his part. This is the time you want to be in sync right here. What do you think is going to be their best move at this point? Tricky situation here. They need some kind of bucket to stay alive. And it's either got to be a three-pointer or a score quickly and take the foul. And talk about stepping up in a big way. I'll tell you, it takes confidence to pull the trigger in that situation. You love guys who relish the moment. He gets the first, and that'll put him up two. And so both free throws good. And it's a three-point game. And so Jason Kidd calls for the timeout. And Coach didn't want to take any chances in this situation, which is why he called the T.O. Any speculation on what we're going to see coming out of this timeout? Tricky situation here. They need some kind of bucket to stay alive. And it's either got to be a three-pointer or a score quickly and take the foul. Doncic on the wing. Leonard defending. No good from three-point range. And they foul intentionally. That's what they have to do at this point. Oh, he doesn't hit the first. That was the one they really wanted. He's got one more, though. And he can't make the second free throw either. Missed them both. And looking to even the score with a huge three. Greg, this is all about execution. Can you free an open man from the three-point line? That's what it comes down to. So it's the Clippers taking the W in a close one. With the late victory, they upset plenty of these hometown fans. They really should take this win to heart. When the pressure was on, they stepped up and worked twice as hard to overcome it. Thank you for joining us. That'll do it for now. For Ali LaForce, Grant Hill, and Doris Burke, I'm Brian Anderson saying thanks for tuning in, and we'll see you next time.